And how about somewhere new to dine out this weekend? Well, a new restaurant has popped up on West 117th. It's opening a decade in the making after escaping war and adjusting to a new country as a family. Emma Henderson gives us a taste of Damas Eatery. Food transcends borders, languages, and in some cases, time. It's an opportunity to explain, actually. Everyone comes in, I have Syria on the menu, like Syrian fette, Syrian cheese, Syrian everything. So they ask, if someone doesn't know what's going on in Syria, they ask me like, hey, what's, what's, what's it like in Syria? And I get to explain. For the Alaham family, their new restaurant, Damas Eatery, brings them back to a time before war, living comfortably in Damascus, Syria, before having to flee to Jordan, then arrive as refugees in America. And they're now newly minted citizens and business owners. We're a big population, not comparing to America, but to the Middle East, it's quite a big country. It has a lot of meaning to the food be here in America. Now settled in their new country with their dream realized, it was time to bring something back to share, the taste of home. Since we've been here, we've been looking for a Syrian restaurant with every traditional maybe dish you could think of, and we didn't find it, everything we needed. I mean, this, this thing is really drives back to Syria. The business is a family venture, and they are proud to share their history with customers. Yassine was on site to translate for his father Marwan, but a father's love and admiration comes across in every language. I'm very, very proud to see them like this. This is my big wish to wish to see, to, to see them uh, grow up up especially all my family together. In Cleveland, Emma Henderson, 3 News.